What exactly is sepsis and why is it so dangerous? Sepsis happens as the body tries to fight off an infection. The body releases chemicals into the bloodstream to battle the invading germs, which can lead to a big drop in blood pressure. This can damage vital organs and, in severe cases, cause them to shut down. That's known as septic shock, and it can be fatal. While sepsis can strike at any age, here's who's most vulnerable. Babies under a year old and those 65 and older with chronic illnesses, like diabetes. People with weakened immune systems are also at higher risk. Sepsis often starts as the result of an infection, like pneumonia, or because an open wound gets infected. Experts say sepsis must be recognized and treated with antibiotics, and fast, especially among older adults living in nursing homes who may be immobile and prone to developing pressure sores or other types of infections. So what are the possible signs? A body temperature above 101.3 or below 95. A rapid heart rate or labored breathing. A change in mental status, such as confusion. Sometimes victims are shivering or very cold, are in extreme pain, or have clammy or sweaty skin. Detecting sepsis quickly is vital. If you suspect sepsis, experts say get to the hospital as soon as possible. While most people recover from mild sepsis, one in every two people who go into septic shock die, according to the Mayo Clinic.